everybody welcome in to some minecraft today we are on bedrock and we are showing you a new mod that just came out or an add-on that just came out so here we have storage drawers which is an available add-on for minecraft bedrock which is amazing because i use this mod a lot in modded java so what this does is this is going to add in some extra drawers which are kind of like chests but better and we're going to get to that right now so here's this bad boy you're going to go ahead and download this and import it into your minecraft and once you're in there what you're going to have to do is you are going to have to turn on some options down here you need the holiday creator features so this is going to give you access to the upgrades on the pack Upcoming creator features is what gives you access to the drawers themselves and the beta APIs is what's going to give you access to actually be able to put items into the drawers. So you need all three of these to actually use the mod. So let's go ahead and jump in and check it out and uh, I'll show you guys how to set up some drawers and how you can use them, how to upgrade them and all of that. So. The drawers are actually pretty easy. So if we just grab some wood right here, and that's it. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna build ourselves a crafting table. Toss that down, we need a chest. And after you get a chest, all you need to do is this, and now you have access to a drawer. Now the drawers do come in, I believe every variety, um, so we do have crimson drawers, we have oak, we have warped, we have birch, jungle, dark oak, and acacia. We also have the drawer controller, which I'm gonna have to create a VIN because as you can see, it requires a diamond and two capacitor, two comparators, and some stone. So this is a drawer. And what this is going to do is this is gonna let us take an item, let's say mm, fences. All right, so if we have a couple of these drawers out here in the row, let's go ahead and drop that drawer controller right now as well. What this is going to let us do is toss these into the box. As you see there, it only holds one item. So one item type it's only going to hold. But if it's in your inventory, let's see if it does that, it won't. But if you click on there again, you can see it puts it into the box. And you can take it out, put it back in, take it out, put it back in. So that is very nice. Oops, my bad. All right. So in order, you can see there, it can hold 2,048 of one item. That's pretty powerful. But as you see, there's plenty of upgrade slots on this. Probably a little bit too many, in my opinion, but they're there. Now, if you don't want to walk across this whole thing, just, you know, clicking and putting items back into here. You can toss down the drawer controller. And what this is going to do is anything in your inventory. See, now we can just toss it in there. So let's say this is drawer controllers, toss that in there. And now they're all inside of here. This way we have everything nice and put away. And all you have to do is click on this one guy and it'll put it into the slot. Now it's not like modded Java where I can just Double click this and everything I have that can go into these drawers goes into the drawers. Uh, you have to actually select the item itself and then put it into, the, into there. But it makes it a little bit faster and easier for you. I can just go, go through my hotbar real fast and put everything back into the drawers that they go into. Now for the upgrades, we can check out the upgrades right here. All of them, we come down to the upgrades. And just like on modded Java, you need the template. So you're gonna grab the template, it's oak drawer with some sticks, and then these little upgrade patterns here as well. The one thing that's good about this, or maybe not so good about this, is that you don't actually have to have the, the previous uh, upgrade to get to the next one. So in modded Java, you actually do have to start with the iron. So you'd start with iron, and then the gold one, for instance, would actually take an iron one in the middle instead of this upgrade. Uh, so you would have to upgrade them individually. This one just kind of lets you do it through. 
Uh, this is still in the works, I believe. It's not fully fleshed out just yet. Uh, we also don't have the multiple drawers, so we don't have two drawer slots and four drawer slots in these. But as you see, uh, Bedrock is starting to get some amazing capabilities in the modding community, and I'm very excited to see where it's going. If this mod, if this little mod video has helped you out at all, uh, please leave some comments down below, uh, and I will look at some more uh, Minecraft Bedrock add-ons, and we'll see what type of things people are doing for our bedrock now because this is starting with this coming in it is starting to get exciting to see what's happening thank y'all bye bye